end of the day, we're going to demonstrate the drug swipe. It's very, very simple. All we basically do is we just release the blue. All I ask you to do is just a little bit of spit into your mouth. I'm going to wipe it on the inside of your cheek, on the right hand side, then the left hand side, then just along your tongue. I'm going to put it back into the device, crack open the vial, and then we have to leave it for eight minutes. Okay? And very, very briefly, just so we explain, we've got a control line which will come red, another line will come red, and if there's any cannabis or cocaine, we'll get an indication with a second line which will appear on the left hand side. Right. Okay? So, when you're ready, let's open nice and wide. <laughs> Side. Okay. So it back into here. You know, crack open the. You can hear it cracking. Yeah. So close it. A couple of seconds at the top. Seconds at the bottom. And then make a note of the time. 11:06. We leave it for eight minutes. Right. Okay. In that time, what we'll see is we'll see the control line start to appear, and that's a red line at the top, red line at the bottom. Mm -hmm. And if there's any cannabis or cocaine they'll show in a second line. If we get an indication of cannabis and cocaine, the person's then arrested yeah. under Section 5A or Section 4 of the Road Traffic Act. Yeah. They're taken uh, over to Compass House mm -hmm. where we do the evidential procedure, which ultimately is a sample of blood which gets sent off for analysis to a forensic laboratory. And they tell us what's in the person's system. Yeah. Hopefully backing up what the wipers told us.